Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new, I post a lot of Clean With Me videos and things like what I eat in a day. I am plant-based and healthy foods for my family. They are not plant-based so we've got a little bit of both going on here and yeah just lots of motivation to keep up with your house and to keep up with your health. So this last weekend was crazy. My little girl was home Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, and my husband was home Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. So there was about five days there that I did not have an opportunity really to work on the house, and when I did, I really wanted to just kind of spend time with my little girl and my husband. So... I guess it makes for good filming though, right? So I am really glad that you guys are here and I hope you guys enjoy this and let me know if you like the music that I found this time. I've been kind of playing around and working on um, finding good music that doesn't have any royalties to it to put on my channel. Um, so let me know if you guys like it and I hope you guys enjoy this and that it motivates you to get cleaning on your own house. Thank you guys for watching. I had so much laundry to do. It was insane. There was probably like 10 or 15 loads of laundry. I swear it was just, oh my gosh, it was crazy. little jewelry box over here was from my grandmother and I got that whenever she passed away. It's one of my most precious things that I have. Um, it was very, very special to me. And right now I was just going through, this is kind of like a catch-all junk area with like lots of papers and things like that. And I was just kind of going through it and getting the trash out of it because why do we keep trash? I have no idea, but we do. We do. See where the moon and water Somewhere close to harmony When the world is sound asleep I just love how the story box has this glass on top of it. Um, it actually comes off and it's made kind of like a dresser with a little, you know, with the mirror on top of it. It is so cute and they just don't make things like that anymore. But anyways, it's super precious to me. I can't wait to be able to pass it down to my little girl someday, um, you know, when she's an adult and responsible and whatnot. <laughs> my sewing box. I have been trying to keep up with sewing projects and things like that. Um, I got away from it for a really long time but I had this friend who came around. Um, I just kind of got acquainted with her last year and she really loved sewing so and she wanted to learn how to sew so I've started teaching her and then it made me want to do it again so I will have a couple of videos coming up pretty soon with some projects, pretty easy sewing projects that I'm going to do. Something's gonna bring the change Journeys we are meant to take Something at the edge of space Calling us to fly
that is my dog. Her name is Dolly. Um, we believe she's a Labrador mix. She was actually a rescue dog, so we don't know um, exactly what she was. But she's a sweetheart, and she's kind of gotten spoiled. She's been in the house all winter because it's been so cold out. And now I just kind of let her stay in even on nice days outside because I've gotten used to her being in the house. But because she's in the house, guys, there is so much hair cleanup that I have to do. Um, I know that that's normal if you guys have owned pets, but I have never had an inside pet until now, um, even all growing up. So yeah, and I'm about to turn 31, so that's a long a long life without indoor pets, and the, the fight against all of the hair is just crazy. Let me know if you guys have any good tips or tricks to keep that down, please. <laughs> My couch was really, really gross because we eat on it. Um, we don't really have a dining room in this house, so we eat on our couch, and my little girl spills stuff down in it all of the time, and there was just like nastiness. I mean, even a little bit of mold because of spilling drinks and then not taking the cushions off to dry underneath them, I guess, or she hid it from me and didn't let me know that she spilled something. Um, I don't know, but I'm definitely going to start keeping up with this better because it was really gross and it was a lot of scrubbing involved which absolutely killed my neck. So, yeah, embarrassing. Okay, so I have a question for my viewers. You see that bar right there? Um, I am going to be painting that soon, and I don't know what color. I wanted to do red at first, like for a little pop of color in the middle of the house, but then, I don't know, I keep going back and forth between that and like a navy blue. So let me know in the comments down below what do you think would look best. Um, we're going to get three new stools to go right there on that side of the bar, and all of that that you see is going to be out of the way, um, so it'll look really nice. This bar ends up kind of being a catch-all in our house. I know everybody has like hot spots where it's a catch-all. Ours is by the front door and then this bar. Like everybody puts everything down on this bar, including me. Um, it's just a really bad habit, but I guess it puts everything kind of in a central location. So when I go to put it away, it's really easy to um, get it all done at once. Of my mind, don't go so soon. 
until you're mine This will not end I'm stopping time Just me and you on time now I am a hippie at heart. This is sage that I'm lighting. Um, I just like to do it, especially whenever I have a really deep cleaning day. It just makes me feel like the air is cleaner too. I don't know, it's probably all in my head, but that's what that was.
This time whenever I went to go clean up my bathtub, it was pretty grimy, so I used um, Barkeeper's Friend. Normally I use crud cutter or just like an all-purpose cleaner and wipe it down once a day or once every other day, just a quick wipe down just to keep on top of it, but I had not been on top of it at this point, so it was time to bring out the big guns. Um, Barkeeper's Friend works really well. I know some people use like the Comet with bleach, but I try not to use very much bleach or things like that in my house because I really don't want to um, have a whole lot of chemicals going on so yeah that's what I use whenever I want to really get down there and scrub it out We recently put in a new sink and we put it in after we already painted our bathroom gray and so whenever we went to go put the new one in and my husband had to tear out the old one it tore off some of the paint and some a little bit of paneling here and there just like the top you know section of the paneling so we're gonna have to touch that up and repaint but this bathroom is still a work in progress but as you will see in a little bit um, we do not have rugs all on the floor anymore we have well at least on half of it so we've gotten um, some of that floating uh, laminate flooring and put it on top and so it looks like wood and it's really really pretty I'm very very happy with it the beautiful floor we still have to put quarter round around the edges so I do not like full-on mop this yet but I will be able to um, 
you know after we get it finished but we've just got half of it done and then over by the washer and dryer we still need to do that area but um, it's getting there and then we're gonna actually carry this on into the kitchen as well the carpet in the kitchen is just not good and I mean who puts carpet in kitchen anyways but yeah I love it just a moment, some time with you, but I'm impatient, and you don't notice the way I look at you, I chose to put the same amount of effort into you, like you do. Talk no more. I chose to put the same amount of effort into you, like you do with me. That's why we don't talk no more. Okay guys, that is all I got done for today. I still had all this laundry to do and I did not get to my little girl's room and I also didn't show it here but I didn't get to the office either. So I did what I could but sometimes you just don't get to all of it and that is okay because I got so very much done. I hope you guys have a good day or night, whatever day or night or time that you're watching this. Um, and thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and the notification bell to let you guys know the next time I upload a video. Thanks for watching. Have a good day or night, whatever. <laughs> we don't talk, no more. We don't talk anymore.